hi, bored. You must be with this lockdown going on, not being able to go to school. That must have been fun in the beginning, but I'm sure it's not fun anymore. Um, not being able to visit friends or do any of the extracurricular activities that you do, play. I'm sure you've been watching TV and reading some books, etc. But how long can one do that? So I thought I would amuse you today by reading some nonsense uh, verses to you that I used to read to my children when they were young. One of my daughters, you may know, her name is Konkona, Konkona Sen Sharma. The elder one, her name is Komolini, her you won't know. Uh, by the way, I should introduce myself. I am Apurna Sen. Uh, I used to be an actress, but you were all far too young to have seen me when I was an actress. After that, I started making films, directing films, but many of those films were for adults, so I don't even know if you've seen those. You may have seen Goynar Baksho, which was a comedy and a fun film. Anyway, we'll start this poem. It's called Jabberwocky. It's by Lewis Carroll, a famous author who many of you may know wrote Alice in Wonderland. Now, what is very, very interesting about this poem is that it's made up completely of nonsense words. As you go along, you'll find yourself wondering which are the nonsense words because strangely, the nonsense words sound very like real words. And in a very strange, nonsensical way, the poem makes sense. So, here we go. Twas brillig, and the slithy toves did gyre and gimble in the wave. All mimsy were the borogoves, and the moam rats outgrabe. Beware the jabberwock, my son, the jaws that bite, the claws that catch. Beware the jubjub bird and shun the frumious bandersnatch. He took his vorpal sword in hand. Long time the mangsome foe he sought. So rested he by the tum-tum tree and stood a while in thought. And as in uffish thought he stood, the jabberwock with eyes aflame came whiffling through the tulgy wood and burbled as it came. One, two, one, two, and through and through, the vorpal blade went snicker-snack. He left it dead, and with its head, he went galoomphing back. And hast thou slain the jabberwock? Come to my arms, my beamish boy. O oh, frabjous day, kaloo, kalay, he chortled in his joy. It was brillig, and the slithy toves, did gar and gimble in the wave. All mimsy were the borogoves, and the moam rats outgrabe. Now, which are the words which sounded like real words? To me, beamish sounds like a real word, because uh, beaming is a real word. Beaming means smiling. Come to my arms, my beamish boy. But there's no such word as beamish, but it really sounds like a real word, don't you think? Now, Shruti Chitra did a lovely, lovely translation of it in Bengali. And the funny thing is that his nonsense words sound very like the nonsense words used by Lewis Carroll himself. So I'll read the Shruti Chitra version. Bili giroi shitle jato tobe galum giri kotche bhewet dhare. আর যত সব মিমসে বড় গোবে মোম তারাদের গেব গেবিয়ে মারে চাসনি বাছা জবর খাকির কাছে রাম খিচুনি রাবণ কামড় তার চাসনি যেথা জুবজু বসে আছে বাঁদর ছেঁচা মুক্তি করে ভার তাও সে নিয়ে ভুরপি তলোয়ার খুঁজতে গেল মাংসমি দুশ্মনে অনেক খুঁজে সন্ধে যখন পার থামল গিয়ে টামটা গাছের বনে এমন সময় দেখতে পেল যে ঘুপচি বনে চুল্লি চোখের ভাটা জবর খাকি আসছে বুঝি ধে হিল ফিলিয়ে মস্ত করে হাঁটা সন 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 চলল তরবারি সানিক সিনিক জবর খাকি শেষ স্কন্ধে নিয়ে মুন্ডুখানা তারি গালুম ফিয়ে যায় সে আপন দেশ তোর হাতেতেই জবর খাকি গেল সুধায় বাপে চামুক হাসি হেসে আয় বাছা ধন আয় রে আমার কেলো বিম্বি আমার বসনা কোলে এসে
বিলিগির ওই শিথলে যত টোবে গালমগিরি করছে ভেউয়ের ধারে আর যত সব মিমসে বড় গোবে মোমতারাদের গেবগে বিয়ে মারে সো ওয়াজ দ্যাট ফান আই থিঙ্ক ইটস এ লাভলি ট্রান্সলেশন বিকজ ইট ইট রিয়েলি সাউন্ডস ভেরি মাচ লাইক দি অরিজিনাল নাও ওয়ার আই ওয়ান্ট টু রিড টু ইউ নেক্সট Uh, is a poem by Shukumar Rai. I don't know how many of you have read Abul Tabul. Shukumar Rai was a wonderful author whose son is Shrutujit Rai. So um, I'm going to read to you a poem by Shukumar Rai called Ganer Guto. Gan jure chen grisho kale bhisho lochon sharma. Awaj khana dicche hana dilli theke borma. গাইছে ছেড়ে প্রাণের মায়া গাইছে তেড়ে প্রাণপণ ছুটছে লোকে চারদিকেতে ঘুরছে মাথা ভনভন মরছে কত জখম হয়ে করছে কত ছটফট বলছে হেঁকে প্রাণটা গেল গানটা থামাও চটপট মাধন ছেঁড়া মহিষ ঘোড়া পথের ধারে চিৎপাত ভেষ্য লোচন গাইছে তেড়ে নায়িক তাহে দৃকপাত চার পা তুলে জন্তুগুলো পড়ছে বেগে মূর্ছায় লাঙুল খাড়া পাগল পাড়া বলছে রেগে দূর ছাই জলের প্রাণী অবাক মানি গভীর জলে চুপচাপ গাছের বংশ হচ্ছে ধ্বংস পড়ছে দেদার ঝুপঝাপ শূন্য মাঝে ঘূর্ণি লেগে ডিগবাজি খায় পক্ষী সবাই হাঁকে হার না দাদা গানটা থামাও লক্ষ্মী গানের দাপে আকাশ কাঁপে দালান ফাটে বিলকুল ভীষ্মলোচন গাইছে ভীষণ খসমে যাজে দিলখুল একটা ছিল পাগলা ছাগল এমনি সেটা ওস্তাদ গানের তালে শিংবা গিয়ে মারলে গুতো পশ্চাত আর কোথা যায় একটি কথায় গানের মাথায় ডান্ডা বাপরে বলে ভীষ্মলোচন একেবারে ঠান্ডা নাও দিস পয়েম অলসো হ্যাজ বিন ট্রান্সলেটেড ইন ইংলিশ ভেরি ওয়েল for those of you who don't understand bengali and it's been translated by professor shukanto choudhury when summer comes we hear the hums of bhishma lochan sharma you catch his train on hill and plain from delhi down to burma he sings as though he staked his life he sings as though he's hell bent the people dazed retire amazed although they know it's well meant they trampled in the panic rout or languish pale and sickly and plead my friend we are near our end oh stop your singing quickly the bullock carts are overturned and horses line the roadside but bhishma lochan unconcerned goes booming out his broadside The wretched brutes resent the blare the hour they hear it sounded they whine and stare with feet in air or wander quite confounded the fishes dived below the lake in frantic search for silence the very trees collapse and shake you hear the crash a mile hence and in the sky the feathered fly turn turtle while they're winging again we cry we're going to die oh won't you stop your singing but bhishma sword beyond our reach how air we plead and grumble the welkin weeps to hear his screech and mighty mansions tumble but now there comes a billy goat a most sagacious fellow he downs his horns and charges straight with bellow answering bellow The strains of song are tossed and whirled by blast of brutal violence and Bhishma Lochan grants the world the golden gift of silence. I hope you liked it. So try and enjoy yourselves as much as you can during uh, this time. Try and read uh, Abul Tabul if you can. It's available online. Uh, in the Bengali and a lot of poets have also translated it into English. So, see you again maybe sometime. Bye-bye for now.